Alright boys, in today's video we are going to be testing out the new godly, the Golden Future Large Clockman. Now, shout out to It's Me Fred, one of my moderators on the show for letting me actually borrow this unit for me to record with. So yeah, we are going to be testing it out today in a clock match here since, you know, that's the hardest thing we can do unless we do endless mode. So yeah, we are going to be going into clock mode, going to be putting it on all skip and we are going to be testing out this mad lad of a unit that only 8.6k exist of so yeah it's time to get into our match all right so as usual we do have our support your un units here the green laser the dj the mewing tv man to you know actually start start this game off so yeah as you guys can see the stats as 7.5 thousand damage 60 percent slowing 50 range a second quarter down and only 7.5 thousand dps but whenever it is maxed out it does 115 thousand damage still the same slowing at 60 percent it goes up to a hundred range which will cover you know majority of this map it will still have the same one second cooldown but the dps will be much higher this time so yeah this unit seems to be insane i mean it does start out 50 but it gets 50 more range after you max this guy out so yeah th this is gonna be this is gonna be insane to play with just to see how much this guy can actually cover with his 100 range it's gonna be insane all right here soon enough we are going to be getting our godly down. This boy does also look like a beast. He does have a cool design from what I can tell. Alright, let's put a mewing right there so everything can just real quickly die as we want it to. So yeah, in about two ways we should have this guy ready to be placed down and then I think he'll be really good but i mean the best thing about him is that he starts out with a ton of range which honestly makes him pretty good i mean i can place him all the way over here yeah he still gets to start and this this track right here so you know even if you place him a little bit far away he can still reach all the way over here so we're probably going to place them, you know, maybe in the smell here. Anyways, the golden is placed down. He is leaping onto these two. It's like it is nothing. And he just decimated all of them. So, yeah, 50 range. It's all already getting all of this. But, yeah, so it has the ultra lightning time stop. It holds the torts in a freeze like safe for 20 seconds. And it also has the lightning power. So, on top of a 20 second time stop, it does you know extra dealt damage so this guy this guy is actually pretty powerful if i had to say you know he has a max out right now but eh, whenever we get a ton of these guys down we will know for sure all right so next upgrade this guy's damage will go to 18,000. so yeah next upgrade this guy actually does get quite a little bit of damage and i think we will actually be getting that grade just here in a moment ah Alright, there we go. So yeah, 18,000 damage, so yeah, look at this. This man can shred through dual blades, shred through me, and shred through bosses. And this is only at level 2, you know. Keep in mind, he will get like 97,000 more damage. But next upgrade, he does get 12,000 plus damage, so he will be doing a staggering 30,000, and his range will also jump to 60, so this guy's range is going to be increased quite a little bit. His damage will also increase a ton, too. Alright, boys, so we have $5,000 here, so we only need about 2,000 more, so yeah. This guy is doing pretty good already. I mean, we haven't even seen anything turn this corner yet, so he only has this little bit of attack range. But now that we upgrade him, he's gonna be one shotting these mini gun torts. Look at that. This turret spider is also gonna be getting chunks of his health just gone in seconds. So yeah, now he has 60 range, so so, you know, eventually he'll be able to reach over to here, over to the start, and, you know, me maybe even up here a little bit. So, yeah, next upgrade, 12,000. So, these guys are actually pretty expensive for it. But next upgrade, he'll get twice the damage, and he'll get 15 range. So, you know, he'll probably be able to 
attack over here. He'll be able to get the star. He'll be able to get this little corner here. So we may have 14,000. Might as well check that theory out. So yeah, look at that. The range is insane on this guy. This guy has more range than the ultimates do, which is quite wild actually so yeah eventually we will need to get a dj tv down to see you know how how good this guy actually does then because right now it, it, see, it seems like he's doing uh, he's faring well you know he, he's oh let's max him out okay now he has 115,000 damage 100 range let's see a lot of range is being wasted over here but yeah it can literally go up to here up to here if it was placed dead middle it could get this whole map but if it was placed right here like a big blob of large clocks the godly ones they all could attack this whole map that that's how much range this guy has i mean he's wasting a lot of range here yeah he can almost get these tracks up here he can almost get this but he's you know kind of kind of chipping it a little bit but now this guy is just one shot in basically everything so how about how about we just make a line of these guys i i think that's a good idea just making a line rows that's gonna be perfect so we have like eight of these guys down now each one of these do cost around 38,000. So this is also cheaper than a chief, but you know, we don't even have our farms maxed out yet. So we might, we might be able to max out six of the eight. So we're going to be able to get, you know, a decent amount maxed out, but we're not going to be able to get all of it maxed out. All right. So we have all of our farms maxed out. Now it is time to start on our second golden so yeah one golden was holding up this whole time but now we're gonna be unleashing an army and also this guy does have the same green attack like the normal the normal mythic the normal future large clock this guy has a green spark that does splash damage and that glitch just got melted i did not even see that glitch i saw and then it just disappeared and but yeah th this guy is incredible now just wait until we get like four of these guys max out you know one or two max out may may not seem like a lot but you know once we get all all these guys maxed out basically oh it'll be looking like we have 19 hypers down okay after we max this one out we're probably gonna get a dj tv down to see how much damage these guys will truly do plus the dj tv watch you boost these guys a lot and also, you know, imagine these guys with the 15% range boost from the uh, from the Chief Clock Man. They are going to have a ton of range. All right, so I have a level for DJ that should be maxed here in a couple seconds because these guys are now just destroying giant blind bolts, which is an everyday thing. Yeah, look at that melted okay so we have a maxed out dj tv let's see so 143,000 damage so that's really good all right let me pull out my cabalculations device okay so the godly almost does 200,000 damage that is not including the damage it does when it does a time stop and that is also not including the you know frequently attack that it does with the green energy so yeah this guy with a dj tv is insane he can do you know as much as the clock ultimate without a dj the drill ultimate with a dj i mean this guy is like one of the best units i'd say i mean obviously he's a godly and obviously you know, it was a recent golly, which would mean his power scale would be definitely up there. But th this guy would just be insane at everything. I mean, want to do a simple nightmare match? Tag this guy along. Want to grind clock mode? I mean, we're way 43 and only 14 minutes in. So you can see we're we're going pretty fast. But yeah, I, I want to try out this ultra lightning time stop whenever we get to wave 50. I want to see how much damage it does because... You know, I think the normal one for the Mythic, it does 80,000 damage. So I'm going to be, you know, testing this out. Maybe I'll do a million damage. Maybe I'll do like 5 million damage. You don't really know. So, yeah, we're going to be checking that out on wave 50. But, yeah, we have 4 max out right here. Probably going to be able to get this. 
and this one maxed out so yeah probably like six in total unfortunately all right wait 48 we got our fifth one maxed out so yeah we're gonna have to set our santas in order to max out this guy out but what should we do with these peeps I honestly do not know. Are they just going to be, you know, the guys at the end, they probably won't even be able to attack. Like, no toilet is going to get to this area right here. That is where these guys, you know, attack. Like, no toilet is going to come here for them to attack. Any toilet actually is going to die before they want to go there. So, yeah. they These guys are getting spawn killed. I have not seen one toilet past this corner right here. Not one. All right. This way 50. Let's our Santas. All right, so yeah, that's six maxed out here. I guess we can upgrade this one a little bit, and maybe even again. Oh yeah, that green spark just took out everything. As you guys saw, so look, it is melting. It's just going through these guys' HP like 900k at a time. Man, let's do ultra lightning time stop. So oh, it does a million damage. So the lightning time stop does do initially, and look at that look at that hp gone in seconds that's 16 million and it is doing it's actually doing more than a million like six of these guys are doing more than a million i don't know if it was because of the time stop but you know they're only doing sparks of 900k so i don't see why they would be doing over a million whenever the time stop occurred but yeah there we go that was an easy 500 clocks easy coins so yeah that guy is insane he would be good for anything he would be good for endless you know th this guy if you have the right requirements i mean this guy is only probably good if you have the dj tv you know i wouldn't really try endless with this godly unless you have dj tv which you know i know it's a pretty big restriction but he does have a splash attack but other than that you know he's mainly single target which can definitely drop his rating down a bit but you know he still has amazing other qualities i mean he even has slowing which he has the uh, highest slowing in the game or i guess tied for the top because astra 60 some other units 60 percent slowing so yeah and this guy also has the most range in the game higher than ultimates this guy also does more damage than the ultimates with dj tv so yeah th this guy is definitely up there on the damage list Hi hyper is getting heavily overshadowed with these new units i mean hyper was 100 percent the best back then both like chief this godly you know some uh some of the other new units this hyper has just faded away and in less popularity every day but that'll be it for today's video there boys we did check out the godly so yeah if you guys do get your hands on this you know it is going to go down in price very quick so you know you can always sell the godly and you know will become cheaper and you have leftover gems that is just you know one path of taking this godly or you could actually grind with this godly you know it is a one percent chance why not try to get multiple yeah that will be it for today's video there boys see ya